My friends would probably say that I talk a lot. I like to make people laugh, but I don't know how good I am at that. <laughs> College was just the best four years of my life. I didn't watch TV, because I was like, why am I sitting here watching TV when I could go on a hike with my friends, or go out, or go, you know, do something? I was pretty young, and I think the weight of what was happening to me hadn't dawned on me. I'd be like, yeah, I'm diabetic, and they were like, what? Like, what does that mean? Like, are you dying? Are you gonna die? I'm like, no, I'm not gonna die. It's just an added challenge. Everyone has challenges, you know? And it's not so much that I didn't want people knowing. I just didn't want that being what defined me. The most exhausting thing for me about it right now is just constantly having to think about it. I'm trying to be my own pancreas and it's just, it's unpredictable and I'm never gonna be as fast as my body is. You know, if it was like an immediate result, like I eat this brownie and then I feel like crap, then it'd be easier to not wanna eat the brownie. But it's more like I eat the brownie and then 20 years from now, I like have terrible eyesight and my feet are rotting or whatever the complications may be. It's hard to think about that because it's so far away. I definitely feel like the doctors are judging me. I think they just expect a lot more from me and it's just upsetting that I'm always letting them down. <laughs> they say all the artificial sweeteners are really bad for you. You shouldn't eat them and you shouldn't do the diet soda because the aspartame will give you brain cancer. And I'm like, pick your battles, all right? I'm living here with diabetes. I gotta eat what I gotta eat, you know? <laughs> it's just myself telling myself something so that I can drink whatever I want. <laughs> it's an adjustment getting used to being attached to something. 24-7. You know, daily things I put in my pocket, it's no big deal, but working out, where do I put it? Swimming, where do I put it? At a party, at like a nice party and wearing a dress or something, where do I put it? If the biotech people want to know what they can do to help diabetics, I mean, they can sit on all they want and like think about ideas like, oh, would it be easier if they had this? Or they could just ask us, like, we're living with this. We know what's hard, we know what's not. Thus far, I have been able to take care of myself, and I'm proud of myself for that. That I'm not entirely sure at what point in my life I'll be able to afford it. Hopefully by 26, because that's about when I have to. Which I think also adds to my career choices. What I'd love is for someone to throw some spontaneous idea at me, like, hey, let's go to Mexico right now. And me to be able to say, let's do it, and get in the car and go, and not have to run home and grab my kit, to be able to jump into anything without having to worry about it. I think it would definitely feel like the real me.